Hey folks, welcome to TTL Media. This segment is Dumb News, and I am not Terry Crews. <laughs> I'm your host, Tim Black. The Klan is doing a neighborhood watch thing out there in Fairview. That's right. They're going to stop the break-ins and you damn blacks and Hispanics and Native Americans, all of you people. So muddy, you mud people. Messing with these good people who are out here making a good living. Damn, I sound like Pat Buchanan. <laughs> I feel like Pat Buchanan. You didn't know him. He got fired long ago. Woo! Anyway, these guys have started a neighborhood watch in, uh, in Fairview. They launched it. They kicked it off. And their slogan is, You can sleep tonight knowing the Klan is awake. No, clan, we can't sleep tonight exactly because you, we know you're awake. You're going to be keeping a lot of people up, man. Pacing. Uh, you're a damn good reason for all people of color to go get an NRA license, become a member, and go get your fucking gun. Now, the clan is trying to rebrand themselves. They say, give give clan a chance. That's the motto. No, it's not. It should be, though. <laughs> it's better than their motto. We are a non-violent organization. <laughs> cool. Look, Clan, you couldn't be considered a non-violent organization unless we changed the word non-violent to mean the word violent. There's nothing non-violent about the Clan. Hello. Uh, is this 911? All right, this is Cooter. And I uh, hope we got ourselves here a Mexican. Uh-huh. That's right, you need to come get him before we have to do something really bad to him. Uh-huh. Oh, no, he, what was he doing? Uh, what was it? Oh, uh, just being Mexican. Uh-huh. In Fairview, though. That's important, no. Yeah, he was being Mexican in Fairview. He thinks it's racist because we said he's being Mexican, but he's being Mexican here in Fairview. Yeah. Oh, uh... How we how we get well? Actually, that's we want to file a charge on him because we were standing our ground and he ran into us. Oh, how would that happen? Uh, well, see what happened was we chased him for about four blocks in our pickup truck, and then what we when he was running, we got in front of him, we jumped in front of him, he didn't stop. So we were standing our ground when we proceeded to knock a couple teeth out of his head. Uh huh. You know. As much as people want to get appalled and get upset, offended by what's going on with the claim there in Fairview, you know, people look outside looking in. What we need to remember is that the Klan didn't just just show up one day out the blue. No, the Fairview County residents actually called up the Klan organization and asked them to come be there. Welcome to America. I'm America. You're yeah, right. Now that is crazy.